Hola everyone! Hey, hey, hey! Welcome back to another episode! We are in Cartagena and ready to explore this cool town! to eat it is kind of crazy weather here I don't know if you guys can see how orange and dusty it is apparently it's the uh, sand from the Sahara Desert so air quality is really bad today All right, guys due to the Sahara sands look at the air quality meter okay we're on this dark purple here which is hazardous to your health and tomorrow um, is supposed to rain so we'll do our best to see uh, what we can capture at this beautiful city but right now we're waiting for food mm, yummy Caesar Got a little fried chicken Caesar dressing look at this sapia it looks amazing this is a stew sapia so cuttlefish and egg on top and I'm not sure what this black sauce is, or maybe an ink, but wow, looks so tender. Look at the yolk. Yum. Looks like a something that eat and I shouldn't smile. With the egg. Mmm. Oh wow. It's so tender. Do I have anything in my mouth? Let me Let's see. So flavorful and the cuttlefish, it's usually sapia can be tough and this one's like so tender. It just falls right off. Look at that. You don't even need a knife. Wow. Alright guys, let's try them. Look at that. <laughs> mm. Oh wow. Mm. That is a meaty rib. Mm. Wow. Mm, that is very, very good. I think we got some little bit of coleslaw here. Mm hmm. Mini corns. Let me ask you guys something. Nikki and I are different. Are you a side to side corn eater by the row? Or are you a round? Comment below. I'm a side to side eater. She's a round eater. Who's right? Do I have anything in my teeth? No. Okay. All right, so we are walking through Old Town Cartagena. We just got done eating our lunch, which was fabulous. Yeah, it was great. <laughs> we'll try to keep our mask on because uh, the air quality is horrible. Yeah. But, but the, the ribs that I had, that was like the biggest slab of meat. Oh my uh, God, that was so much. In the meat sweats over here. Oh, I could barely finish it. <laughs> well, my cuttlefish was great, except that it was very, very black. <laughs> so, like, I had to be very careful eating it because <laughs> it gets really black. Your teeth and your mouth and everything gets black. <laughs> <laughs> so, we are heading over to the most famous attraction uh, the Roman Theater. The Roman Theater. So, um, We'll see you guys over there in just a minute. Yep. All right. So <laughs> we just walked all the way around trying to find where to get in because everything seems to be closed and we couldn't find the entrance. So apparently we asked the security guy, there's here is the Plaza Ayuntamiento, the main square. Which is where this building is. Yeah, so you don't walk up directly to the Roman theater. You have to go through this museum to get through theater. I don't know how, but we're going to find out. All right, guys, six euros each. We are now on an underground path to the theater. Escalator all the way up here. It looks 
like this is how you get to the theater. We went completely wrong way. <laughs> This impressive Roman theater was built at the end of the first century under the reign of Augustus. It was in use for 200 years, then abandoned when the Roman power waned. All right, so we're inside. It's pretty majestic. It is huge and it's beautiful. It's pretty impressive how well they preserved this. It was discovered during some construction work in 1988, and then the restorations were completed in 2003. It is the most visited tourist site in the whole region of Murcia. So we're getting uh, some unique coffee here at the main plaza. It's called a Cafe Asiatico. I don't know why it's called that, but there is a concentrated milk and obviously coffee and then there's a liquor 43 the liquor 43 from what we read is the one of the most exported uh, alcohol in spain so very unique it has a uh, milk um, cinnamon on top and there is a little the coffee bean so it looks pretty good oh look at that it it's, smells amazing oh yeah it smells the cinnamon mm -hmm. Looks like a, something perfect to drink on this uh, little chilly and weirdly sandy orange day. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> That's actually pretty strong, but it's pretty delicious. All right, guys, so we just had our Coffee? high calorie coffee bomb we are walking right over to the beach or to the uh, marina so the marina would have looked a lot nicer on a sunny weather but this is travel right you can't never expect the weather or anything I mean like, who knew that this whole Sahara sand thing is going to happen today but that's how trouble is. Make the best out of it. Alright guys, we are back in Valencia. We hope you enjoyed the video. See you next week.